That's not it. Certainly is. Is and is is. is. <laughs> Try again. All right. Oh. Here you are. Oh. What happened? No, that's the E. No, that's it. Oh. no it's not. It is. Isn't. Is. Isn't. Is. Isn't. Hello, and welcome so everybody. You You're just in time Fine. for more Bioshock Infinite. Hey, in the last episode, we got back on the First Lady airship, and as you can tell, we crashed. Um, primarily due to Songbird. So, are we the last? You certain? Quite certain. That's the Being completely wrong. shattered, though. It's quite close, but it's wrong. So it kind of looks like there's still That's glass. The yeah, it looks like there's still glass here. Huh. It's weird. Kind of but anyway, um, we need to open this door and stop. Uh, I'm assuming it sounds like the loot that is out there. From. Stop it! You don't know what you're doing. Not sure what they're doing. You've done it now. He's. He's coming back, he's coming back. The notes were correct. The instrument was not. One needs both to get his attention. But if you know how to uh, sing to him... He will take you where you need to go. Hmm? The car. Who are you? We are where we are needed. And needed where we oh. are. Some Comstock uses these songs. Are there others we can use? Something to keep the bird off our back? Perhaps you should ask the maestro himself. So where is he? <sighs> Of course. Well, at least they left the piano. Oh, we can only push the piano. Uh, I'm hoping you'd be able to play it. <laughs> um, that would be that would be a cool idea. Like in order for That's you to. That's Comstock House. Oh wow! We're gonna find him. We should start there. The box are coming. Yeah. We need to leave the dock. What they should have done with the piano, and this would have been a really cool thing. Um, is if you approach from the front, you can play it. Or if you approach from the side, you can push it. I don't know how hard that would have been to program, but that would have been a neat little touch. Um, wherever the Vox Populi ain't. So in other words, it's time to raid the stuff they're gonna leave behind. You need to remove your belongings, or we can't take any more people. The barge is full. You're going to have to remove some of your luggage if we're going to pick more people. Yeah, in this situation, I'll say a suitcase full of whatever clothes you could carry, and maybe a backpack full of food or, or some sort of survival supplies would be the would be the most you want to carry along with you. Especially when you're in the middle of a city that's being overtaken by a group of people, good or bad. You probably just want to get you know the bears in. And you know you're walking. Um, though in all honesty, I'm not sure what good the Silver Eagles would be would be uh, anywhere else in Rapture. So yeah, your money's essentially worthless. <laughs> that's kind of puts in puts in perspective. Well, that's also that's also another thing that I just thought of. Like money, is, money is technically only worth. Uh, only worth as much as we as as a society agree it's, it's worth. If we had a free, if you had a free the country, you wouldn't have access to your account. Therefore, the money that you have that would be quote that would be worth something here or in whatever country you're living in wouldn't be worth a thing in other countries. Uh, so we got finally damage boost for RPG. So let's go ahead and do that. We got one more upgrade. Um, let's see, do they have it here? I don't think we can get it yet. Um... I should probably try upgrading something else, but really I want to just focus on my Diggers. You know, I haven't really been able to do that. The Diggers and Rocket Launcher are pretty much the only two things I truly care about. Um, I'm just going to have to fight that guy, so let's go ahead and... Do it! Coming into Mosquito. Black oh! Um, right there, we got the control in the water puddle so we need our uh, sock jockey over here. But the, the problem I have with the water puddle is it's a very situational ability. You have to make sure they're right over there. Bleeding. Booker, catch. Ooh, yes, I am. Thank you. 
Um. That's all I have. There we go. Um. Oh, I oh, Here, ammo. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that's a lot of ammo. So good. <laughs> um, probably should be using more bigger. Oh, that's a lot of ammo. So good. Um, probably should use more bigger. So good. Um, Oh, no salt, thank you! Okay. We got her on in the field. And then you can get some... Uh, actually, I'll try to charge her. There we go. Charge can be really fun. I guess if I have to, the charge would be really fun when it's really like melee attack. Um, but I really think it should it should have been kind of something that sort of replaces your uh, your melee attack like that. Like you do, like you tap that and you tap and charge. Like it's still taking it's still it's taking soft and everything, but I don't know. It shouldn't have been a, it shouldn't have been a, like on the bigger wheel. It just kind of. It just kind of seems like it's pointless otherwise. This one. Do you think he wanted any part of this? Did you? We're getting some train mates to slow down, but hopefully that's going to be too much of an issue. Still a powerful scene, despite the, the team friends isn't there. Oh. That, le that uh, lag spike. Um. Well, I got. Well, would it be frame spike? I guess. Cause lag, lag would. Found some money. Oh, thank you. Lag would imply an uh, internet connection. I guess it'd be a frame rate spike. You just call it a frame spike or something like that. I'm not even sure if, it has a, if that has an official name. I think it's just everyone just classifies any kind of slowdown as lag. <laughs> um. Well, technically, technically, it is right though. Um. I got a burst gun or something. Oh yeah, I know it's just like a burst rifle. Uh, um, like the it's like the repeater. It's like the repeater that. Wow, well, the repeater kind of sucks. I think it has more ammo though. They might have more ammo, maybe more penetrating power than the machine gun. Um, that's the cost of a slower fire rate. Um, so anyway, we need to go in here. Um, fancy putting those lock picking skills to work. Looks simple enough. What is it about that song that brings in the bird? It always has. When I was younger, I used to be excited when I heard it. Excited? He was all I had. He fed me, brought me books. He was my friend. Friend? Until I grew up. And I hated him. Because he was my warden. And he's just Comstock's pet, isn't he? Just like me. All done. Yeah, it's kind of hard to, uh... It's kind of hard to picture Stongbird as anything more than just a mindless beast, especially considering that we only see him like a handful of times. Once people um, get their blood up, it ain't easy to settle it down again. This is on our well, hands, isn't it? Lockpick. There we go. Let's go. Let's see what bigger it's gonna get. Shock, shock chain ad. Possession for flash pros boost. That's always a good one to get. I'm not going to get that. We're going to get crows boost for three stun durations. That fully upgraded uh, crows. Um, 
Possession for Less is, is worth getting because it like halves the amount you use, so you don't need as much salt to use them on the machine. They're gonna use possession either in combat or out of combat. Um, that one's very useful. The chain, the chain aid. It's the bottom go ahead to chain flow. Oh yeah, that's the same as pretty much that. Um, Brief of vulnerability on attack and recharge your shield. That's useful for a charge rate, for a charge if you use that a lot. Um, if I could ever figure out how to use Undertow, that'd be, I'm sure that'd be useful. going on there. I spent that entire time trying to possess this machine. It would not let me. There we go. Oh. Well, I don't know why I looked through there. Do it now. Alright. Okay, and we're gonna need the Go on without me. There we go, that's a, that's how you do it. Okay. It means to fight salt upon death for a percent of the time. Oh, that could actually be pretty good. What do we have here? Yeah, go ahead and push that out. Here's some cash. Ooh. Here you go. Thank you. Oh. Might actually get enough to upgrade another vigor. It's locked. <laughs> On it. Ready. Okay, so what do we have the uh, pe uh, heater ammo. The heater is basically a shotgun, but not as good. Um, actually, I think it's it's a more powerful shotgun, but it's got like two shots before you have to reload. Well, maybe it's one. I don't remember. Um, let's look at this. A great shield. Um. Yeah, you know, the infusion, you basically don't ever need to upgrade your health. Um, I'm not even sure there's enough to do it. Uh, there's enough uh, to upgrade every every last bit, so like, you have enough to upgrade like two of them fully, but you don't have enough to upgrade all of yeah, the other. Um, let's look at them now. There you go, okay. Yeah, so you don't have, like, you upgrade, uh, like, you see what I'm doing, I'm upgrading, uh, salt and shield. I don't think there's enough to, f at least, at least not enough to fully upgrade health. Um, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I think this is a little stronger than the, uh, the machine gun. Um. The bad one fires faster and Well this one has a fan though. Like a little bit. Wow. I don't imagine this one would have had more because it has a bigger barrel. Or it has the one looked like a bar bigger barrel anyway. And then again, I follow I follow, you know this logic and business. It's... You don't think anyone can really see the future. Do you? I saw something once when I first got here. A dream. It was New York, but larger than any New York I ever saw. It was burning. Hmm. None of the prophet's magic is rubbing off on you. Oh. The war enemies on here, okay. 
Oh look, it's the evil ever released the robot. Did I say earlier that that needs to be a thing? Evil robot Lincoln? No, evil robot Lincoln is a thing. That's from Futurama. No, evil Lincoln is from Futurama. They have robot Lincoln. They have 16 different personalities. All of them are Lincoln. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Oh, that was kind of pointless. <laughs> Probably keep my, uh... uh here we go. All my vigors right now are pretty powerful, so it's like... Uh, then it's on. It's starting. And don't worry about that. Can you get this open? <laughs> I can do that. The main reason I'm not worrying about the alcohol in this game is that I just don't want to well lose health or salt, you know, because... Let's look over here real quick. Is there anything? Look through this telescope. Let's just see two inches in front of us. Okay, that one might be. Eh. It's like two and a half inches. <laughs> yes, yeah, I'm not really impressed with, the, with that, with the telescopes. Um, oh, we could have gotten a motor I think on our side. It actually looks it looks like it's uh watches the model, so it's probably like uh Tom stock. <laughs> it really does kinda of bring up the idea of more of wondering like where these things are coming from, what universes are coming from. And whether or not we're the bad guy technically I in that universe. Who those two are. They well at least she invented the technology that allows the city to float. Giant balloons. Quantum particles. Mm. Suspended in space-time at a fixed height. So, not giant balloons? But the thing is, my book said they disappeared several years ago. I told you they'd come. No, you didn't. Right. I was going to tell you they'd come. But you didn't. But I don't. Are you sure that's right? Something tells me they're not exactly what they appear. I was going to have told you they'd come? No. The subjunctive? That's not the subjunctive. I don't think this syntax has been invented yet. It would have had to have been. Had to have had been. That can't be right. They seem to want to help. They seem to be out of their minds. Odd, isn't it? What's yeah. odd? The fact that we sometimes... Finish each other's sentences? Exactly. It would be odder if we didn't. <laughs> How do you suppose they manage that? I'll get back to you after I figure out the floating city bit. Yeah. Um, there's a there's a box of that actually does explain why they why they're able to do that. Um, Come on. Yeah, let's just put it this way. Th there. Those two are um, odd. Um. I think there's, I think there's a couple of. Uh, I think there's a couple of uh, box of clones that kind of explain it. Whoa. Nowhere to hide. Huh. Um. Oh, hand cannon, yeah. I remember, I remember back when I first heard the hand can heard the hand cannon, I was like, that sounds awesome. Something with the power of a cannon in the, in the palm of your hand. It's a See pistol. Shall it's actually a revolver to be more back. He was grooming me, wasn't he? Comstock? Yeah, I think so. And why lock me up? I'm guessing you didn't. <laughs> Don't oh, I didn't stay on top that. forever. Ha, look at him now. Hey, this guy, great idea. Okay. Actually, no. I got a better idea. I'm just gonna try to finish off that. That was easy. Okay, so get some money here. Wanna money hold there. on to this? Yes, thank you! Oh, Elizabeth. Oh, I love you. Uh, okay, so... What else do we have? Okay, I love you. Okay. Wow. Some of these other things is a dog build machine. Um. Yeah, 
a lot so before I can get shot. Oh no, no, we only need about a hundred more, so that's not too bad. Okay. Um Oh, we can find it close enough, we might go back and get that real quick. The district's out. Execute anybody who looks like they give us trouble. Anyone with a gun, anyone wearing glasses. Round up the rest. Anyone wearing glasses? Uh, uh, I'm wearing glasses. <laughs> so that's kind of scary. Mr. Comstock, when we next meet, it won't be the parlor. See, I went out to that Hall of Heroes to scalp your false shepherd for you. Turns out, though, DeWitt speaks Sue. He helped me to swap words with this crippled child I've been, uh, looking after. Now, after hearing how the kid has fared in your city, I'm thinking when we take your no, pelt, I'll let him hold the knife. <laughs> oh, damn. Okay, so all that's to take care of you. Oh, okay, it's locked. Oh! Okay, so that's to take Don't know if enemies know I'm in here, though I'm assuming they do. The unfortunate thing about the AI in this game is that it's not quite as good as what they had in the original Bioshock game. Um, damn. Um, so we're still in the combat. I can't find it sad that we can't pick block all that. Uh, I need a restart. Yes. Can you fire the guy fire the fire guy? Yeah. So I think we're done with battle anyway. Um, now I gotta wonder with the shock jacket ability, what is this type of a crystal? Like according to the lore of the game, something that could generate electricity like that. Does it imply that it's there? Well, that got destroyed. Can't lose it, unfortunately. Um, right here we can go ahead and. Need some help with this. Let me see. There you go. I forgot. Got enough. I'm not just for to Want to take a look at this? Really? That little old lock. <laughs> it's done. Things what are you? The sad thing about this. Thank you. There we go. The sad thing about this is that we're there's no one on our side right now. Like we have like no allies. And yet we're stuck in a little war that is trying to kill us, or both sides trying to kill us. I don't know about you guys, but I don't feel very, uh... I don't feel very, I don't feel, uh, very confident at our, abil at our abilities right now. <laughs> What's wrong one? Oh. Uh, look. 
Right, I'd murder Crow there for a sec. Um, let's see, what do we have? Uh, nope, nothing. Found some money. Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, Elizabeth, you are the best. Uh, did I just? I think I just reloaded there. Like I didn't like it just automatically reloaded when I did that. Cool. And um Yeah, I'm not sure I want to use those toilets. This is brother rival club. Okay. This is brother arrived in Columbia! Columbia Great Science is just her twin! A physicist as well! Another genius? Who ever knew she had she had kin thin? So yeah. Hmm? Oh, clothing. Could you talk to me a little time and what do we have here? Yeah, we're not gonna do with that. Um, the funny thing about taking the gear is that it's almost pointless to take the gear and that's just gonna replace what you currently have. <laughs> um, it, it, just, chances are you're not gonna go back and do it for the one because it's just so... It's so tedious to try and do that, but at the same time it's not like it's a huge noticeable deal, you know? Oh, full well, off, okay. That's all I didn't. Okay. Um you are right now. I think um now be as good as any time to Yeah, end the episode off. Drive the in the next battle. Um, okay, the next episode we'll be heading on that way toward Watch the Grand Central Depot, and I was not even aiming at you, Elizabeth. Because I was aiming at your general direction doesn't mean I was aiming at you. Of course, my aim, I might as well have been aiming away from you at that point. <laughs> Actually, the better, the better joke would have been with my aim, my aim standing right in front of the gun would probably, or standing right in front of me would probably be the best, the safest spot to set. <laughs> Sad part is, I'm not even kidding. My aim is terrible. Anyway, that little bit of tidbit. Um, next episode, we'll be heading towards the Grand Station, the Grand Central Depot, hopefully making our way to Comstock and confronting the bastard. But until then, I'll see you guys later. <laughs>